Very loud. I've never seen it explode like that before. Great fun watching everything explode and freeze and just shatter. The oxygen allows the materials to burn very rapidly. So three, two, one. My show is called Chemical Miracles, Magic, and Mayhem. And it's basically a, uh, a show that uh, is intended to show some of the wonder and excitement of chemistry. What we are doing is causing an oxidation reduction reaction with the silver inside the body. When I do demonstrations, it's to illustrate that there is some aspect of uh, your life that I am showing you is tied directly to chemistry. Uh, I'm always trying to excite students about chemistry, so I do lots of hands-on demonstrations in class to illustrate the different chemical ideas. My chemistry show was born out of that. The world is made up of atoms. Chemists treat atoms like they're Legos. They move them, they place them, they build new things, and that's what the science of chemistry is all about. It's about saying, look, you know, looking out there at nature and saying, these are all the things that are out there, but why isn't this out there? You know, let's either try to find it or let's try to make it. Chemists see the world, the materials of the world as their medium, and they try to tinker with that to make it a better, more useful place. There's a very close relationship between the students and the faculty. I can tell you, I was a student here at Clarkson University. I was an undergraduate chemistry major at Clarkson University. Uh, and the interactions that I had with the faculty convinced me to go on and get a PhD. And uh, eventually when the opportunity to teach came back, uh, came up, I came back to Clarkson University and I have been teaching the first year large chemistry course ever since. I love Clarkson, you know, uh, I think it is a phenomenal learning environment.